Hello and a welcome, Digital Silver Foxes, to the iCloud.com how-to video. So, in this video, you're going to learn what iCloud is, where you can find it, and what it can do for you. So, iCloud is Apple's cloud storage platform. So what the heck does that mean in layman's terms? That means if you have pictures that you took on your iPhone and if you're hooked up to iCloud, that means even if you lose your phone, you can still have your pictures. And this applies not only to your pictures, but also your address book contact information, your reminders, calendar appointments, etc. This service is awesome because I have a story where I lost my iPhone and I actually recovered it because of iCloud.com. So that's a little bit about what iCloud is. Now where can you find it? There are three places where you can access your um, iCloud data. You can find it on any of your iOS devices. That means all your iPhones, your iTouches, your iPods. The second place you can find it is on your MacBook, whether it's desktop or laptop. And the third place where you can find it is iCloud.com. Now if you're not on this site already, head on over to iCloud.com. You'll be taken over to this home page. Now sign in with your Apple ID and your password and hit enter. Boom! You're gonna be taken to a page with nine different apps. And just to do a little bit of intro, I'll just briefly introduce them. One is mail. You automatically get an account when you sign up with Apple with, with the mail account. That's web-based. And you have contacts. So no matter where you misplace your phone book, I don't know if anyone uses that. You still have your contacts if it's in an iOS device that's synced to iCloud. And you have calendar, so you can make appointments and share your calendars with your family or your coworkers. There's notes, so if you don't have a piece of paper, you can still, you know, take notes and reminders, which is similar. And lastly, my favorite function, find my iPhone, which you actually can use to find your iPhone. And there are three more beta applications that I will talk about in later videos. Thank you for watching the intro video on how to use iCloud. I'll see you in the next videos.